Hello everyone, how you doing? Welcome back to the Nuzlocke that I am returning after I think six months. Funny enough, I started this in January last year, and now I plan to finish it January this year, hopefully. Actually, I don't know January, but to sum up, if you did not see the training arc, um, because that was basically the previously gone video, I have teamed up everyone. I got tired of waiting for the ice berry, which is what my original plan was. Let me go ask her, because that is... Let me see if I can be able to get it. If you did not know the reason why I was gone for so long, is that I kept asking for a damn berry, because the float seal that this guy has, Crasher Wake, knows ice beam. So... So in order to actually stay a chance with my one Pokemon and completely wipe everything, um, I needed that berry to protect against ice. Never got it. Not once. At a certain point I had to start, um, I had to start, st I had to stop. Like I, I didn't save beforehand because I was getting too many berries. So I tossed them out and kept the ones I had now because it was... Is getting a little bit too much, and at that point it felt like weird farming. But yeah, finally said screw it and decided to train up the Pokemon. So here we go. Uh, what's the general strategy here? Hopefully survive. We have Yaoi, who is now at an acceptable level, who will hopefully not die instantly. We give her an item. Yaoi has the big problem of getting crit out of nowhere that has not changed even while I was leveling her she was almost dying uh no big group won't work with her <laughs> I'm trying to think about what what freaking items can I give her I don't think there's any Let's see, in case she gets whacked by something is there oh we got that I'll give her a shuckleberry just in case um, so basically here's the way it's gonna go. Yaoi's gonna take out his first Pokemon, which is a Gyarados. Grazy is gonna take out the Quagsire. And then I'll switch into Gibble and hope that the Gi hope that Gibble over here can survive Float Seal and put him to sleep. And if I can put him to sleep, then I'll switch back into maybe probably Yaoi and finish him off. The big problem here is that, uh... It's a big tanky boy, so let's go in here. Let's see how this goes. But either way, the Nuzlocke continues, regardless of how many Pokemon we may lose. I have to solve this stupid puzzle again. All right, here we go. I can solve this, no problem. Oh, smart, I would've done it beforehand or just kept talking while I was doing everything else, but I didn't think this through. <laughs> How the hell did I solve this? No, I got it. Watch out. It's gonna be real funny when I can't solve this. Am I going backwards or am I going forwards? Yeah, just that I was going backwards. Okay, let's see. Go here. Like that. You just gotta follow the path of the trainers and you'll know how to solve the puzzle. So at this point, I'm gonna have to fight this guy. Everyone here has already been beat multiple times, so it's fine. So that means I'd go around here. Yeah, yeah. There's this, this guy. Go here. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Oops, wrong thing. Is this really necessary for Crasher Wake? Seems kind of redundant based off the whole machismo thing that he's got going on. What does he have? A random stupid bubble? Alright, let's go. Ah, uh, let's hope for the best. I'm just gonna ask that Yaoi does not get completely smashed in the first go. <laughs> it's also been a very long time. Let's go, lead awake. Yeah, it, it, I am not lying when I say during multiple times of the training she got very close to being crit killed by random Pokemon that were no were like even lower level than she was 
Come on, don't die to this. Oh my god. Are you serious? <laughs> Why? Why are you like this? <laughs> Why? I should never put any faith into my sister. And well, now here's the bad part. If oh, he's gonna withdraw because he knows. There we go. Okay. We got him on the run. That's good. Alright, we're gonna switch into crazy. Because Yaoi you can't. She has no moves to take down a Quagsire. Yeah, there we go. That's good. Now, unfortunately, Grazy can't be used too often because uh, the Burning Hammer, which I totally remember from the last time we used, uh, has one issue with it, and the big issue here is that Burning Hammer deals a lot of damage to yourself. <laughs> so I'm gonna do this Wood Hammer, and this Quagsire is going to die instantly, just absolutely get folded. The problem is, is I just took a lot of damage from that as well. Alright. Good so far. Go Float Seal. to switch into Gibble, and the only reason I'm doing this is because it's time for Gibble to finally put up or shut up. I'm tired of Gibble being on the team and not, see, he told you, Ice Fang. That would have absolutely killed him in one hit. Are you kidding? <laughs> Why? 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 Oh, thank god, I actually had Ice Heal. I can't believe that that fucking got me. It dealt 11 damage and then throws me. It knows crunch. Oh, thank god it doesn't deal a lot of damage. Okay. Hypnosis time. Come on, buddy. Don't get crit. Okay. Bag. Go up here. Heal. Hyper potion. I also forgot during the side point of training to fill up on items. So this might go much worse than I anticipated. Brian? Eee, jeez, why does Brian do much of damage? Alright, come on. There we go. Okay. I'm gonna very quickly heal up Gibble, just in case. Oh, you know what I'm gonna do? Which would be a good idea. Iron defense on Gibble, make it impossible for him to hurt me. Actually, I don't know if Brian is a attack-based move or not. I could look that up. But for now, I'm going to Iron Defense and see if this works out for me. It should at least stop Crunch from absolutely destroying me, unless he gets a crit. Well, we're about to find out if Brian is a defensive move or a special attack. It looks like it's a special attack. Okay. Gibble is a tank of sorts and not dying. That's good. Most of my Pokemon would have been dead by now. Yaoi yeah, would have been dead. Hypnosis. Really getting tired of your shit right now, Flood Seal. Also, really getting tired of your shit, Gibble. Oh god. I'm surrounded by Pokemon that cannot hit their moves. This is also why I wanted to wait for the Ice Berry, because I knew for a fact that Yaoi and Gibble would let me down when it really mattered. You got it. No more back-talking on Gibble. You missed again. Okay, Gibble. Once again, you're gonna get this Hyper Potion. And if anything else, apparently you're just going to remove Brian from the equation altogether. Brian can't have that much PP in it, right? It is at least doing less damage every single time he's used it. There we go, god damn. Ah, I'm gonna push it again. Okay. I really wonder how much damage Gibble would do. 
I'm afraid of actually switching out now. Yeah, because it wakes up very easily. Let's see how much damage you do, Gibble. Ooh, it's a decent chunk. Oh, thank god. He switched to Crunch. How dare you, Crunch. Oh, that must mean he's out of brine. <laughs> if he switched back to Crunch, that means he's out of brine. Which means if I can go back to my iron defense strategy. Because I don't think Gyarados has any special attacks either. So that would mean that the impenetrable defense would be the thing that wins the day. This all makes sense in my head. Let's see if it works out. Alright, let's get back to it. Gibble, you're back on the menu for being good on the team. You need to show up everyone that didn't believe in you, including me. Now here's the question. So will you automatically die the second Gyarados comes out? Stop, stop lowering my defense, Fort Seal. Tired of you. Get your giant give me a hug face out of here. Leave my presence. That's a lot of EXP. Some to Grazing. Grazing has EXP share. Why does Crazy have EXP share out of all the Pokemon? That was a good move. Thank you. Alright, well, I really wish Yaoi had not missed that uh, Thunder Fang. Because if she had not missed that Thunder Fang, this Gyarados would be dead. And she would have switched into Quagsire, and then the, everything would be over. But now we have to deal with Gyarados. Oh, you also know Brian? <laughs> Oh, thank god. You have the shit um, special attack. Let's go. Hypnosis. You know what? Bringing her in. Come on. Yeah, we literally trained for this. If this kills you, I swear to god. I'm gonna yell at you in real life. Please don't crit. Not like this. Okay. Come on. <laughs> Come on. One hit. <laughs> oh my god. This fucking fight is over. And I can finally get back to actually playing the Nuzlocke. Let's go. Thank you, give me my fucking badge. Wake. Wake more like whack. TM55, thank you. Thank you, thank you. Leave me be. Oh my god. So happy. Now we can actually start, I can start training up the other dudes in the meantime. It won't be a whole training thing, but I'll remember to do it now. Ah, uh, please don't fight me, you. Oh, it's Grand Cross. That's right. Thank you. Rawr, 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 rawr. I love Grand Cross. Master? Team Galactic. Oh, I have to go fight fucking Team Galactic? They have a bomb? It's another one of those Team Galactic bastards. Alright, I'm gonna save up, and we will continue this on next time. But thankfully, now I can actually use, uh, Grazy without fear of Grazy immediately getting stomped. Let me take that from you, the Rapper. I'm also gonna start training up the Rapper, because I just need someone with a lot of HP to potentially take some hits. That is what, uh, that is the reason why I have decided to start training up uh, the rapper over here. Oh, you had quick claws, right? Now, who had. Now I'm confused. How, do you, how the fuck did you have quick claw? It was supposed to be on Crazy. What item do you have? No, I know what item you have. Yeah, but what item do you have? Okay, now I know. 
Everything was all screwed up. That could have gone terrible without me even realizing it. But yeah, that's the end of today's video, everyone. I hope you liked it. I will be back with more. Don't know when videos will go up, but I will figure out a day and start releasing them. I just figured it'd be good to end the Crash Awake arc and say, done. Till next time, everyone. Have a good day. Peace out.